Hey guys, we just wanted to tell you about our new merch. What? We have new merch? Are you serious? Yeah, and it's so cuddly and adorable. Oh. Wait a minute. Do we have unicorns? <laughs> Daisy, of course we don't have unicorns. But we do have snugglers. What? They're adorable. Snugglers are your adorable, squeezy, cuddly friend. I want them, Molly. They're so cute. We also have backpacks and t-shirts. You guys can check it out by going to starsquad.shop. Now it's time to get to the video. Oh, this is so annoying. What? What is it, Daisy? It's the same episode of Brook High that I've seen about a million times. So boring. Mm, I don't know. I don't care. I'll watch it again. Especially since I get to eat this delicious popcorn. We never have popcorn at my house. Really? Why? Because my brother eats it as soon as my mom gets it. Like, she buys it from the grocery store, and by the time I go to have a bag of popcorn, he's eaten all ten bags. Wow, your brother sounds like a pig. <laughs> yeah, my mom says he's having a growth spurt. And he can only fuel his growth spurt with popcorn, a pair, Wendy. <sighs> I don't even know what to do right now. Well, at least we're hanging out together, Daisy. I mean, that's pretty fun, right? Yeah, I guess. Wow, don't make me feel bad or anything. <laughs> Sorry, Bookie. I just I just wish something well new would happen. Something magical. Well, girls, magic is what you make it. Yeah, right, Mom. There's no such thing as magic. Well, mm, I think you could make your own magic. You could go outside and jump rope. No, that doesn't sound magical. Ah, uh, you could go swim in the pool. Ooh, that sounds fun, Daisy. Yeah, see, Brookie wants to do it. Nope, does it sound magical? I'm in a bored funk. Oh, I hate those. Those are the worst. I wish I was bored, though, once in a while. Oh, it seems like I'm so busy being a grown-up. Trust me, being bored is not fun. And I'm so far down in this funk, nothing will get me out. Oh, I just wish more than anything that something magical would happen. What, 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 what was that? Um, it sounds like the doorbell. I'm not expecting anybody. W -w what's this? A box? It says Unicorn from Amazon. Oh, no, Daisy. I think that's supposed to say Unicorn, but there's tape over the sea. Oh, I... Wait a minute. Is this a real unicorn? I, I didn't even know Amazon sold unicorns. Well, Daisy, maybe it's from, like, the Amazon rainforest. Whoa. Is that where unicorns live? I have no idea, but you asked for something magical, and your mom said maybe you could make your own magic, and, and here it is, shown up at your doorstep in a box. Well, let's open it. Things like this never happened to me. Seriously, this is amazing. Mm. Mm. Probably not as amazing as this popcorn. You're obsessed with the popcorn, Brookie. I just got a unicorn. Correction, Daisy. What you have is a box that's marked unicorn. You don't know what's inside. It could be a prank. Good point. It's probably not magic at all. Excuse me. Is someone going to let me out of this box or what? Um, did you just hear somebody talking from inside the box? I sure did. Open it up. It's, 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 it's a, a unicorn. It's like a little baby unicorn. It's so tiny. Hi, I'm a unicorn. Uh, yeah, we guessed that. Holy guacamole, what are you doing in Brookhaven? I mean, you, you didn't have to come to my house. Nothing cool ever happens here. Well, today's your lucky day, because I only get to spend one day with humans. And this is the day I chose, with you! Holy guacamole! You mean you only get to visit humans once in your whole life? Until I'm a grown-up unicorn, that is. Then I can visit humans once a year, and I'll have magic. Ooh, will you come back and visit us? I don't know, depends on how cool you are. Well, we could be very cool, right, Bookie? Um, what's the coolest thing we can think of, Bookie? I know. We could take her to the water park. Um, we could take her to the water park. What's that? You're gonna love it. Just wait and see. Wow, this is the water park? Holy guacamole, this is the coolest thing ever. Kind of makes me want to be a human. 
Well, almost. <laughs> Being a unicorn's pretty magical. Wow, look at this giant pool. I'm gonna jump in. Ah, that feels amazing. Whee! I mean, nay! When you're in the human world, you have to act like humans, though. So I'll say wee instead of nay! What do you think, little unicorn? Do you like it? I love it! What else is there to do here? Holy guacamole, you got tall. I know. <laughs> it's just part of being in the human world. Our bodies sort of have strange things that happen. Sometimes we get super tall. Sometimes... Ah! What happened? You got hit with a pool noodle. That guy's rude. Don't you know you should never hit a unicorn? That's got to be bad luck or something. Anyway, come with me. I'll show you what else there is to do. Okay, but if I all of a sudden become very small, it's because, well, like I said, strange things happen to unicorns when they're on um, planet Earth. It's okay. I totally understand. Wow. What's that? It's a water slide. Oh, it looks kind of dangerous. No, it's completely safe. Although your brain will probably think you're dying when you're going down it. What? Yeah, it's what we think is fun. Wait, you guys have a really strange sense of fun. Oh, she's going to love it, right? Totally. Okay, now you see that giant slide? All three of us can go down it at the same time. Should I go down the blue one, the green one, or the gold one, or the um red one? I don't know. Well, wait for us, man. You're super fast. I'm going to go down the green one. All right, guys. Let's do this. Whoa, I feel like I'm going to die. Oh, that's kind of fun. Whoa, dying no fun. Dying no ah, fun. Oh, okay, you guys were totally right. <laughs> that was so creepy and fun at the same time. Humans find funny things fun. We love doing things like that. It just makes life feel, well, magical and exhilarating. Yeah, we can show you some other slides if you want. I think I think I want to stay human forever. Really? Um, I I don't know about that. You were born a unicorn. Eh, who needs my magic anyway? Well, what's your magic do? Oh, I'm gonna have a very special job. You see, I'm taking over my mother's duty of making sure that the sun rises and sets on planet Earth every day. Um, I'm pretty sure that's really important. <laughs> you should probably stay a unicorn. Yeah. Um, I think it's a bad idea that you stay on the planet. What? No, I, I'm going to turn into a human, and, and I won't have any magic, but I'll get to ride on water slides, and... But we need the sun to come up every day. Your job as a unicorn is very important. Now, we'll try to make your day as magical as possible, but then you have to go back to unicorn land. Fine. You guys are kind of party poopers. Let's go on another slide. That'll be super fun. And then maybe I can turn into a human without them knowing it. ha, ha, ha. What's this? A cannon? Holy guacamole! That looks crazy! Whoa! <laughs> Another cannon! Oh, wow. I can see the entire world from up here. Wow. Humans sure do have a lot of fun. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, so much fun. I was bored for like an entire day to wait. I would give anything to be a unicorn. I'd give anything to be a human. Really? You must have lost your mind. No, seriously. Being a human seems pretty cool. Come on. I'll show you some other cool spots at this water park. Another cannon? Okay. If you say so. Whoa! <laughs> oh, man. This reminds me of when I'm flying as a unicorn. Only faster with water. Hey, <laughs> wasn't that fun, little unicorn? It totally was. Hey, what's your name, by the way? Sparkles, what's yours? Daisy, I guess we should have told each other that a long time ago. Now come on, I'll be right there. I'm going to use the little bit of magic I have to turn into a human. Holy guacamole! Oh, wow, I think I might actually have a sunburn. <laughs> That's not good. Ow, ow, human skin gets sunburned. Wait a minute, you, unicorn? Where'd the unicorn go? I am the unicorn. <gasps> no! You turned into a human? What's going to happen when the sun goes down? Um, it'll go down forever. But don't worry, I get to hang out with you forever, too. This is bad. None of the plants will grow, and, and, and I'll start getting mold on me for never seeing the sunlight. We'll all turn into vampires. You have to go back to being a unicorn. Nope. 
gonna go wa ride some more water slides. It's gonna be fun. Watch this. <laughs> Wee! <laughs> wow! Oh, this was such a bad idea to wish for magic. Now our sun's gonna go away. <laughs> yeah, but I can have fun. Wow! <laughs> I don't know. This unicorn seems very naughty. Wee! We're all gonna fall in the waterfall. Whoa! <laughs> I love being a human. Oh no, the sun went down. Never to return. You don't understand. You have to go be go to back to being a unicorn. I can't. Once the decision's made, it's done. Oh my god, we're gonna live without the sun forever? No! Well, I don't think it's that bad. I guess. Oh no, this is bad. This is so bad. Well, um... We could always go down another water slide. Ay, ay, ay. Wow, it looks like the maternity ward is full of mamas about to have their babies. Such an exciting day. I love when the maternity ward is full. It means so many beautiful babies are going to make their way into the world. Except for my sister, she's gonna be ugly. What? Who who said that? Am, am I hearing things? Hello? Is there a ghost in the hospital? No, it's me over here. My mom's here to have an ugly little bratty baby. I'm the only baby that matters. Oh, <laughs> you must be Laura's daughter, Molly. Yeah, and she doesn't need another baby because I'm perfect. Oh, being a big sister at first is kind of hard, Molly. I know you feel a little jealous, but trust me, you're probably going to love your baby sister very much. I don't think so, lady. I don't think you even know what you're talking about. I'm going to go to my mom's room and see her. Oh, my stomach doesn't feel so good. Oh, that's probably a little bit of gas, Laura. Here, I'm just going to tap on your stomach and everything should be better. And tap, tap, tap. Oh, sorry. Ew, my mom farted. It smells horrible. Ah! Molly, come back here. I'd like to see you, please. What is it, Mom? Can't believe we're going to have another baby. I'm all the baby you need. Oh, Molly, it'll be great to have a little sister. Trust me. I don't think so. Okay, Molly, I think it's almost time for your baby sister to come, so I'm going to have you wait outside, okay? Pull the curtain, please. Yeah, whatever. I don't want to meet her anyway. Oh, do I pull this curtain? I, I can't do it! Why don't you do it, doctor? Isn't that your job? Oh, she's a grumpy one, huh, Laura? Yeah, she's my little demon, that's for sure. That's right. I am a little demon. <laughs> don't you forget it! Oh no, my sister has arrived. Okay, Molly, you can come in now. Your baby sister's arrived. Aren't you excited? No. Ugh, she's, she's ugly. Molly, don't talk about your baby sister that way. Rude. She's such a sweet little angel. She's not an angel. Take it back, Mom. Take it back. Molly, what are you wearing that hat for? And then, and did, 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 did you grow a tail? Yeah, I'm a little demon. Of course I did. I have a halo, Mom, because I'm an angel. Of course you are. You're such a goody two-shoes. So sick of you being my sister. I, I hate you as my sister. Molly, oh, go in the other room. I can't even look at you. You're being so naughty right now. Fine. I don't want to look at you either. I think you're both ugly. <laughs> and now I'm going to jump on the couch. <laughs> I'm jumping on the couch. Ooh, I could make fire in here if I wanted. <laughs> What's that smell? It smells like something's... <gasps> Molly, did you start a fire? Uh, yeah, I was feeling a little cold. I like things nice and hot. Oh, you're such a little demon. What am I going to do with you? Why can't you be more like your sister? I did all the dishes and I vacuumed the floor. Oh, aren't you just perfect? Well, I am an angel. Girls, it's, 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 
insane that I gave birth to a demon and an angel. But you guys have to try to get along, please. Nope, never! Hey, loser, what are you doing? Oh no, not you again. Please, please, Molly Demon, just leave me alone. I need to study for my test. You're such a nerd. Well, if you were cool, you could be a cheerleader like me, but you're not cool. Watch me do my cheerleading routine. It's amazing. No one wants to see you do your cheerleading routine, Molly. Boring. Hey, my cheerleading routine is amazing, and you all should watch right now. <laughs> <sighs> Boring! So glad you're over it now. Can you leave, please? Wow, for being an angel, you sure are rude. Only to demons. I'm nice to everyone who deserves it, which is pretty much everyone but you, Marley. Hurley, are you okay? Um, yeah, thanks, Angel Daisy. I, I just need to study for this test and... Boring! I'm gonna go to the gym and practice my amazing cheerleading moves. Oh, I can help you with that math assignment if you want. Um, I totally get it, and I know it's really hard, Haley. Oh, could you really, Daisy? That would be so helpful. Sure, let me just um, get my book out. Okay, here we go. So, problem number one seems kind of tricky, but if you think about it in a different way. Seriously, Daisy, you really are an angel. Thanks, Haley. I try my best. Welcome to Daisy's Orphanage, little girl. Everything's gonna be fine now. You can have plenty of food and love until you get adopted, of course. Come on, you can come meet some of the other kids. Hi, I'm Brittany. Oh, hi, I'm, I'm Sam. Hi, Sam, you wanna play with these toys? Yeah, sure. It's my mission as an angel to make sure that every kid who doesn't have a family feels loved and that they have a home in Brookhaven at Daisy's Orphanage. Time to enact my plan of retiring on a beach in Bora Bora. <laughs> well, hello there. <laughs> I'll be with you in just a moment. Um, you'll be with me right now or else. What? What? What are you talking? Why do you have that fire extinguisher? Um, you're about to find out if you can't behave yourself and give me all the money. You're seriously gonna spray me with the fire extinguisher? I might. See, full blast right here. Oh my God! You can have everything you want. Just don't spray me with that, please. It'll really hurt. And also, I just had my hair done. Uh, okay. Well, I won't mess up your perfect hair if you give me all the money right now. Okay, fine, take it all. Stacks of cash, stacks of cash. I just got me stacks of cash. <laughs> now is this all of it, banker man? Yes, every last bit. Please, now just go. Okay, but first I'm gonna spray you with this. What? No, stop! Oh, I gave you the money. Yeah, but I'm a demon, I'm evil. Duh. <laughs> nurse, nurse! What's it take to get a cup of coffee around here? Man, they're so lazy. I should curse them for life. Molly, is that you? What are you doing here? You're just glowing. You're so good. Ugh, makes me sick to my stomach. Well, Molly, you, you are on your deathbed. And, and well, I came to plead with you one last time. Turn from being a demon and be good. An angel like me. Turn from your evil ways, Molly, before it's too late. You think that after all this time, I want to be like you? <laughs> that doesn't sound promising. Look, you can live forever and be beautiful and, and young and, and good like me. I can't age. It's just impossible for me. <laughs> I'll live forever, all right. I'll live forever. Molly, are you... you, you, you a demon zappy? Spit it out, Daisy. <laughs> now, I'm going to chase you forever. What? No, I don't want to spend eternity with a zappy chasing me. Please, no, anything but that. No. <laughs> it 
it's your fate, Goody Two Shoes. It's your fate! Go to the cemetery where you belong! <laughs> so, is it better to be an angel or a demon?